Welcome back to Chef Club. Today, we're cooking with fire. Gonna take a handful of salt. It's gonna form a little bit of a rectangle. Bay leaf, fresh thyme. I'm gonna grab my beautiful pork belly and then I'm just gonna go right on the bottom of it. If some of the rub falls off, don't worry about it. Push down ever so slightly. All right, so now we're just gonna fold it. Now you want it kind of snug, so we're creating a little boat. Hold it in. We're gonna grab our salt. We're gonna pour a little layer, even it out. We're gonna have our pork belly. We're gonna place it right in the middle. And then we're gonna pour salt all the way up. Make sure you spread it around. Now it's ready to go to the fireplace, so let's go. Wow. All right, so now we're just gonna place the pork belly on our piece of wood there. We're gonna grab a little shovel, and we're gonna get the embers from the bottom, put our little shovel here. Then we're gonna place them right on top of the salt. It's gonna take a little time to cook, about four hours. Every hour, make sure that you turn it. And we have to make sure that we always have embers that are a little bit hot, like this with the color here, on top. I replace the embers every 30 minutes. It's gonna keep the heat in. So now I'm gonna make a barbecue sauce. Dry rub that we have, kitchen. Must mix Jack Daniels Tennessee Honey Whiskey. Now we're actually gonna take it out. Just gonna shake it off. Be very careful whenever you're taking it out. It is skewering time. Grab your barbecue sauce that you made earlier. And what we're gonna do is you're gonna brush it on the top, sides, and bottom. It's actually gonna enhance the fire flavor and also a little sweetness because we added brown sugar to it. It's time to flambe. We're gonna add our Jack Daniels whiskey to our pan. And do you hear that? It's still hot. Pretty cool, huh? All right, gonna add a little bit of aluminum foil right to the top, and we're gonna cook it. All we're looking for here is just to get a little bit of the barbecue sauce to caramelize around the outside of the entirety. So I'm just gonna hold the skewers. And you see how we're getting those good bubbles here? Where it's caramelizing the sugar. All right, so now we have our beautiful, juicy cooked pork belly. From all of us at Chef Club, enjoy.